you know merit itself is a very a concept with a scam you know it is really very false concept why i am saying this we need to go further for example when darshan one of our friends here at iit uh, he committed suicide okay so after that some of the professors has claimed that uh, this has been the output of uh, mental pressure he was forced to isolation he was too to get isolated from the mainstream students and all but we need to understand two basic concepts first the forced isolation and second isolation by choice so he was not a person who was who got isolated by choice but it was a forced isolation and when we say forced isolation what it is it is actually the environment around you it is actually the interactions the behaviors around you from the peer students from the professors and also the other elements it is actually forcing you to get alienated from them for example the behaviors when they get to know about your ranks when they get to know about your caste when they get to know about your categories all these things brings a very radical changes into the behaviors and also the interactions uh this is pretty evident because uh, in the spaces like iit this is also very evident because a uh, couple of months ago the case has happened when i mean this is just a case but uh, it is really very prevalent that uh, people change the behavior after knowing your ranking here now when we say about this rankings and all uh we talk about merit and all why i said earlier that it is the case of you know the idea of ranking or the idea of merit itself is really very uh, artificial why i am saying that because we need to understand this from an example for example in the places like iits or in the any spaces but we will be talking about the iit space in the classroom when the academics when the academic engagement has been imposed on you it is coming in a same manner okay but ultimately there are when we talk about the class the classroom it is the heterogeneous group coming from the different locations based on their caste gender religion so when it is coming when the professors tell that we are imposing or we are providing the same infrastructure same instructions to them that is true but when it comes to the student it is not accepted at the same level by everyone it is due to the caste location it is due to the gender location it is due to the intersectionalities within them so in such situation what we can do there are certain students who come with uh, social capital what we call as social capital okay and their social capital is actually getting translated into the idea of merit the so called merit what we come up with the uh, idea of merit it is the social capital is actually getting translated into merit now what happens the so called merit idea they elevate the idea of merit and uh, they make it as a tool to combat this academic situation okay which is provided by uh, the teachers or administration what we can say so but the students who are coming from marginalized background were not having that social capital which is uh, you know uh, the baggage of social capital which the upper caste student brings it is completely missing to marginalized student and therefore they have nothing to translate into the uh, idea of achievements and all what we can say or they have nothing to translate into merit so if the idea of merit is itself is a very biased idea and how we can you know justify the idea of merit and justify the idea of itself okay so in the case of marginalized student he or she is having nothing to translate and in certain situations it is the role of institutions it is the role of institutional body to provide that support to the students whether it is mental support whether it is all the other uh, related supports okay in such so, situations uh, uh, just uh, saw a post uh, social media post uh, by APS, appsc that uh, uh, stating uh, how insensitive the uh, counselor is been I mean, like who is not a, who don't want uh, caste based reservation Uh, or the people to be in campus so how 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 even if support system like that exist in campus will help that support system helps immensely because that's what i am saying in certain situation we need such support and in if we lack such support from whether it is scst cell whether it is uh, other mechanisms which has been established for to support 
mentally and or physically and also in the other manner to the SST students, if that support is lacking from multiple bodies, it really creates a problem. The most important thing is that it will be providing uh, it will be providing support to the students. But going beyond that, institute needs to go beyond that. It needs to sensitize the student. It needs to you know ignite the sensitivity within the students because it is really evident in the uh, IIT spaces. Whenever you will see it in the uh, mess area, dining hall, the you will be questioned about your caste, you will be questioned about your merit, you will be questioned about your uh, you know rankings and all. And these discussions are pretty normalized. So it is the uh, responsibility of these bodies what you are talking about the SST and the other bodies to make the upper caste student particularly sensitized about that this is not normal this is not something you need to you know uh, this is not something uh, be there in your discussions and all it is not so much normal and it, it can create uh, very it, what it can create we have been watching this so this is the main responsibility of this uh, that sensitivity uh, the creating the sensitivity within the students at the ground level yeah. Uh, from the uh, marginalized communities or even from the non, non brahmin communities background, so we always say that uh, education is a way to get emancipation. So, But uh, we are sending our students through reservation to get education, but unfortunately these institutions kill them. So uh, how, how you think on this? So this is really very complicated question plus also very, you know, uh, sadful question because what we have been learning it is really very evident that education is only the mode not only education but the higher education is only mode which has been providing the social mobility of what social mobility to us and uh, in that certain situation if you are you know uh, cutting our social mobility tools itself it will really it, uh, worrisome for us so uh, when they are providing the grounds like reservations affirmative actions if they are providing that grounds, it is also important to ensure going beyond that. What I am saying, I am not just saying about, I mean, our discussion should not be around only reservations now. If we need to sustain on the campuses, our discussion should go beyond the reservations. Our studies, our academic studies should go beyond the reservation. What after reservations? Okay. If that institutional settings is able to ensure the student that promised uh, support post reservation that is most important our discussion should be on okay thank you thank you sir